One is Gragyani. He wants to develop knowledge. Pandit. Right? <laughs> you ask Pandit. Still his doubt is there. I say Pandit. He's a Jnani. He wants to know. <coughs> One is Yogi. <laughs> and one is Bhakta. You see, three, three parts. Three is there. The Where you want to be? Jnani, Yogi, or Bhakta. <laughs> this word I want to show you. <laughs> All are transcendental. I don't I disagree that they are not in transcendental practice. They are a spirit. But one is Jnani, one is Yogi, one is Bhakta. Go on. Lord clearly tells Arjuna that he is making him the first receiver of a new parampara, the Celtic succession, because the old succession was broken. It was the Lord's wish, therefore, to establish another parampara in the same line of thought that was coming down from the Sun God to others, and it was his wish that his teaching be distributed anew by Arjuna. He wanted Arjuna to become the authority in understanding the Bhagavad Gita. So we can see that Bhagavad Gita is instructed to Arjuna especially because Arjuna was a devotee of the Lord a direct student of Krishna and his intimate friend. You see, again friend. <laughs> Relation or not friend? Therefore, Bhagavad Gita is best understood by a person who has qualities similar to Arjuna's, that is to say, he must be a devotee in a direct relationship with the Lord. Jnani yogi cannot understand Bhagavad He will understand different ways. Without relation with Krishna, it is very difficult to understand Bhagavad Gita. Or to Krishna even. My, my knowledge, mind cannot understand. Like a sick blind person wants to see the elephant and he catches the tail and he says that, oh, this is elephant. <laughs> One catches the nose and he says, this is elephant. <laughs> and like this, everything starts fighting with different ways. You know, only you can see from your mercy of the Gurudev, when the divine knowledge will come, prem bhakti jahavate, avidya vinas jayate, vedegaya jaharasavate. That by the grace of Gurudev, by grace of sadhus, when this divine vision will come, and by grace of mercy, prem will come in relationship, then everything will become true. Now, see one thing more. You know the relation, everybody knows about that. Right? Prabhupada, right relation. Go after that. Read that chapter down. This one. Uh -huh. Five relations. Five relations. Yeah. Arjuna was in a relationship with the Lord as a friend. Of course, there is a gulf of difference between this friendship and the friendship found in the material world. This is transcendental friendship which cannot be had by everyone. Of course, everyone has a particular relationship with the Lord, and that relationship is evoked by the perfection of devotional service. But in the present status of our life, we have not only forgotten the Supreme Lord, 
but we have forgotten our eternal relationship with the Lord. Every living being out of many, many billions and trillions of living beings has a particular relationship with the Lord eternally. That is called Swarup. What is the meaning of Swarup? Your spiritual form. And this sloka means when the sadhu come in the spiritual self is within your head. That spiritual form is important. If I am not fixed my form, I will live in marginal forest. This way, that way, this way, that way. Let us pass it, marginal. This sarup is the goal of our life. My spiritual form, identity, to know this divine vision, I got it to know that sarup. And next slide. By the process of devotional service, one can revive that sarup, and that stage is called sarup city. Siddhi means you have to develop perfection to be always in that. That is the goal of our life. Automatic can start clear because you are related. What is the doubt? You, everything will be crystal clear. Where you will read is a related with Krishna. And you are related, so it is it too clear to understand? I am not related, I am here and there, so it's clear it's not happening. <laughs> Doubts are there. When I am the marginal, material and spiritual, material and spiritual, because I have no relation, I don't know my identity, then it makes difficult. is a very important subject. That time, he said to me, Saru, Sadhu means who live in Saru, and Sadhu means who live in marginal potency. <coughs> but I like this word. I asked two times from him, really, Saru living in Saru? Then I remember Prabhupada. Sadhu means who live in Saru. In a spiritual fixed is form with relations. Like Arjuna fixed friendship, Jesus fixed his form as a son to father. This Saru is important in our life to fix relations with them. You are hungry. with your Prita. Premi and Premaspad, lovers. Beloved says, always lover with you. Only we have to fix my relation, Premi and Premaspad. That is devotion. Then everything, every action, every relation will change. All the relatives is not your relatives. They all is the Krishna you see everywhere. Everywhere you see different visions. The beginning's vision changed to see. All not non relation become relatives. Because of, of the reason change and life change. You and yours, 
your, your lover, you see Jetadeh go, Jetashamai, what happens to Jaitanya Mahaprabhu? He see every place over there, he see every place Vrindavan, mm -hmm. he see every place Krishna. Because of he faced in Radha Bhav. That saru make him to look every place to Krishna. And he is teaching by that way that when this life will change in my life, that I will come out from this material and be fixed in that saru in my relationship. That is a spiritual practice. That is a this is nistha, this is asakti. Here is asakti. Then this bhav asakti is easy to understand. Nistha easy to understand. Faith, firm faith. No doubt in this. And nistha, asakti, attachment, important. Is not that you become detached. People say you renounce. I say no. I am attached. I am attached. My attachment make me renounced. You attach other one place, renounce other place. That is secondary. Is not primary. Primary is attachment. My attachment is the primary. Sambandhya can make you in fixed your identity and outside. That pray, then you are related in loving and changing with the Lord. Radhe Radhe Gauravinda to know about the conjugal love of Krishna. He likes only to feed Krishna, only to care Krishna. Everybody has a different, different bhav. And everybody is fixed in Altai bhav. They have no time to go for even the different bhav. What about other subject? Philosophy, they don't need to know. They want to be in that bhav what they got. Arjuna wants friendly bhav, right? One wants motherly bhav. He lives mother. I know one mother, Italian. He introduced, he showed me. Sanatani and Ravana. By the grace of his Gurudev, 
his bhav, sanatani bhav becomes so fixed in vatsali rasa that she, she has a vatsali rasa, only one subject in her life. Maharaj, disciple. We'll see, I can show you somewhere. Huh? Kalindi? No. You are? Yes? I don't understand. So, you can ask him and he will talk to No. So, I see. This this is the this is the thing. I'm talking different subject you as we are. No? So this you was there. Oh yeah. Now you was there. Yeah. This How, first time you were. First time. Yeah. How you see? This completely fixed. You see. This is I. The, what to do in life? To, we have to fix ourselves at time. Right? This is the goal of this source. To how to fix my bhav as time. Not marginal. And she, you see, the mercy of Guru Dev, her bhav is fixed. And all sannyasis want to go to her. All, whole, whole, whole uh, in one month she received six, seven sannyasis and preachers. And how much they are very limited income. Siddhi, perfection. Guru Kripa. Saran Sahaj Madhani Vasanila I try to convince her with Madhuri Rasa. She says, Sadhu Maharaj, I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> Rani comes from time to cook to the soda, but yeah, this I understand. <laughs> she said, I don't understand this Rasa. I understand that sir, Ram, the soda, but yeah, like. When Radha come and cooking for Krishna, this I like. Oh, I don't understand. <laughs> I think yeah. Yeah. this chapter. Mm-hmm. Wow. I said to all the devotees, go and touch, take the dust of the mother. This is the strike of. We sannyasi cannot do what she is doing one month in the motherly body. Instead, as I established, feelings is established. This is fortune. What is the use of this life? To fix this. Why we come? To fix something in our life relation with the Lord. Prem Gali Atisakari. This is very narrow then. We have to walk wash alone for that. Radhe Radhe Govinda Govinda Radhe 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 Govinda Govinda
yesterday, you told us that uh, we should follow what the GPS is showing us, not just watching. I, I also see today. <laughs> but today, but today, you know, we were in the same car, and there were three GPSs, and they were showing different things. So I think it was a special revelation for us that this happens also in the Vaishnava world. Sometimes very highly elevated Vaishnavas have different opinions on the same topic. So my question is, what should the devote, what should be the vision of the devotees? Because they are very sensitive if somebody is having different opinion from their Guru Deva. So how to see this plurality of opinions between the Kari Vaishnavas? One thing I found in this time, also I got what we like to say. When one GPS not working, why? Because he has no sadhu sangha. <laughs> no sambandha. No sambandha. His connection is failed. One and one is no sadhu sangha. You oh, one devotee open his GPS and one open other GPS. When the sadhu sangha start, he can connect. He also connected. Your GPS also connected. <laughs> <laughs> and all GPS is talking the thing. So sadhu sangha and connection is also important by the end. <laughs> Sometimes our false ego make us crazy that now I no need any connection, no guru ashram. I become guru now. <laughs> Ashali Jijan Krishna Bhaji, Krishna Mahi Taji, or some Maraya parent. Today, this GPS is going, you are going to throw that. No, because his altar was broken. His altar was broken. He was not in the center. Ego was very high and he started dancing many things. <laughs> 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 well, yes, that we offered another gift here. He, yes, he also, that third, when three sasana started happening, he also centered out. <laughs> <laughs> what you wanted to say, Mahabharata? Huh? He told, I told him this story when he was driving. Yeah. Yes. No, I called to Muni Maharaj, I say, because I was in a different place. When they start, they want to be also there, and Maharaj come, because I was busy from running, all day running. Mm -hmm. So, I had very strong desire to meet you there, but if a little more far away and you come earlier, maybe you stay only half an hour, I cannot I leave. So then I was driving very fast, no? So maybe some obstacle came that uh, the singer And then he called me, where are you? As I said, I'm 10 minutes in front of you. That time you came out and with You see, I have a close friendship, but he is not one of them, I think. So Krishna, he... Yeah. 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 Thousand, from 2000, when I come, I don't know where she is bringing me, and she brings to you and to that's <laughs> and I don't know. I I don't know before you, right? And I, I don't know Muni Maharaj also that time. time. The first time meeting, and from that day today we are all sitting together. Remember. You remember I? I remember that day. We went to far away to three hundred kilometers. Yeah. When we listen, Maharaj comes, we stop our distribution of sweets, go in car. Come yes. again. <laughs> and I mean in the Maharaj sitting there, we speak about this out. I remember this thing. Yes. This is Vrindavan. When we develop relation in our spiritual identity, when we start living in bhav, 
you cannot come out from Vrinda. Where I see is there. Every circumstance is there. And this reason comes only by the grace of Guru Dev. Divyagyan, Prem Bhakti, only Guru Kripa. Thousands book you read, it will not come. Ha! Ah, one story of Gauraki Shodhara Kauri. One Banda person, he was, he had thousands of books, he read hundred pages every day. And he was very pundit. He comes to Vrindavan. And he, he was so much full of ego that he, nothing he means, he said, oh, only Bhakti Bhakti. There is no philosophy. You know, I know everything. One day he went to Gorky Shurubhat Bhava. Say this story. Yeah, so say no, no. no, it's he, last, he last said, Bhakti, time. Bhakti in Vrindavan is two paisa. Two paisa, you will get the bhakti. Prem. Prem. Two paisa. Vrindavan, two paisa, you expand, you will get. He said, Ah, oh, Maharaj. He said, Go, that time, two paisa was the cost of Prem and Teach and Trita. He said, Go and buy this book. It was a book like a, like a 10 page, 15, 20 page, 25 page. He bought it and brings. He said, Maharaj, Guru Dev, he said, only 20 page. I need 100 page every day to read. <laughs> what do you say 20 page? I cannot understand this. He said, yes, try to read it. One time, two times, three times, when, how much you can read? He come after two, three days. He said, Maharaj, he said, he said, ten minutes is I can finish it. He said, try to read again. After that, he no come ten days. After ten days, he come and catch the feet and he's crying. He said, Maharaj, what book you give me? <laughs> when I read one line, one word, I see the whole book I read. It's all in one word. <laughs> huh? It's all, all philosophy, what I read, is one line. All books is covering. I cannot go more than uh, one slope. I only start meditating. This is true. When you go into a is Prem Bhakti Chantrika. Prem, when the Prem is coming, then Bhakti, this is the real moonlight in our life. All darkness will go out. When you know yourself, you identify yourself by the grace of Guru Dev, mercy of Sadhu Sangha, right? See? Right? Say something. You come there. 